Hello and welcome to Lord Fenton Gaming Plays Resident Evil 2. I'm your host Lord Fenton. In today's video we are doing the G Stage 2 Sewer Boss fight. And we're going to go into the underground uh, facility after that. Alright, let's check everything out before we surge ahead and explore this area. Let's see here, that's that. That is that. Looks like everything's good to go. I am going to combine gunpowder with uh, gunpowder. Give me some more... Uh, hand ammo uh, ammunition cuz we're gonna need that yes we're definitely gonna need that all right I'm gonna go down here go explore a little bit all right there's some blue herbs that's good all right all right on the right track all right there's a green one that's nice and let's go over here and let's see here there's a room all right this is where you uh, do a puzzle before we uh, do that we're gonna combine some uh, things all right, the, uh, before we do the solution two, I'm just looking around. I think that's it. Solution is one, two, and four. That's the uh, answer. All right, the power's up. We can save Ada now. Yes. Oh, man. Not you again. Thank goodness it's not Mr. X who's going to get you now. Yeah, we just got to be careful. He keeps on swooping. Yeah, it looks like he wants to uh, take a piece of us out. And I did a bad mistake of not uh, moving to the right spot. Well, at least I got the green herb, so I'm alright for now. I'm just going to keep on running around this room until uh, I believe uh, Mr. Uh, G, who's in stage 2 now, is going to go after us. Yes, you just got to keep on dodging until he goes after you. It's kind of like trying to imitate Mr. X stalker playbook. He's doing a terrible job. At least Mr. X does it much cooler. And I think that is it for the claws. I think he's going to try to bust in that door now. Yeah, looks like it. Alright, so you know what we're going to do? What we're going to do is run. Yes. And I got swiped because of that. Oops. We're just going to keep on running. Just get far away from him as possible before we... uh lure him to a nice location to kill him at yes we're gonna kill him there and there we go uh, there is a crate and a crane so object is to um, uh, weaken him enough and then use the uh, crane to knock this big old uh, crate to knock him out and off the ledge yes you gotta do enough damage to him in order to do that uh, if you uh, don't what happens is is a uh, it's going to be long and drawn out, and you will die. And also, if you get away of the uh, crate, uh, you are the one who will uh, take the damage to him. All right, we uh, weaken him a bit. I think it's more than one stage of uh, him knocking us down. I'll do it. So I'm going to try to do uh, better. Let's see over here. Come on. I'm not going to hurt you. Honest. All right, that's one stage. My mistake in this video as a recording, if I want to do it one way, was is... I have to time the uh, crane use and then shoot him while he's down as a, as is a certain way. If you do that, then what happens is, is uh, he goes down much faster. Oh boy, he is not happy. He is not a happy camper. After all the damage I did to him. Alright, some more uh, mag bullets. Yes. There we go. We'll shoot him one more time. There we go. That's three mag bullets. He is down. I think it was my mistake. I activated the crane way too soon. Yes, folks, make sure you do not do that. I should have got to the point where I got the fourth stage. That's what I realized. But still, hey, it's fun fighting him, though. There you go. And that extra ammunition did come in handy from the um, locker room. Yes, the sewer locker room. There's some there, which is really nice. There we go. He is down. I think I should just activate it, then shot him up or through the... Uh, Flashbang then shot him up. Yeah, that's just uh, I'm just reeling at the t at the time of this uh, video I messed up and I think I got him. Let me see All right, that was a fail however great news is is uh, he has red eye that means he's uh weakened so if you get him to a red eye phase uh, Then you can have your chance at him um being one shot it yes that's correct one shot it with a bullet 
I would advise doing it with a handgun when it's one shot it it's much quicker than the uh, mag or the lightning hawk I should call it really mag is a bullet but still just keep on shooting him until he's uh you know down oh boy I got nicked again that's just great and I got nicked a little bit but thanks to my power of my shield I'm doing well there we go he is uh, down I'm gonna try it again hit the button I'm gonna keep on shooting him yeah I'm using the mag to uh, lure him down some more and I think that's it right there Mr. G is defeated As a famous saying uh, says, don't come back no more. That is correct. Do not come back no more. So that boss is now uh, done for now. Uh, I missed the trophy slash achievement to uh, knock him down uh, once with the crane, and that's it. Great news is that door will now unlock. Yes. It's a nice shortcut. So let's get to Ada and uh, open the uh, garbage shoot up or waste disposal. Ada! Ada, where are you? Over here! Ada! I was getting worried there for a sec. I can't get it out. I, I don't know if I should, uh... Just do it. I can't walk like this. Okay. It's gonna hurt. <clears throat> Hold on. I can do it myself. Just relax, okay? So, what do we do now? Get yourself out of here. While well, you still can. I'm not just gonna leave you. Not like this. You don't understand. The situation's worse than I thought. You're not getting rid of me that easy. You protected me. Now it's my turn. I didn't realize we were keeping score. Grab my shoulder. Don't push it, rookie. Okay, I'm just trying to help. Watch your step. You want to help? We have to get to the nest. Nest? Umbrella's lab, right beneath us. Net let it slip. That's where the virus samples are. You up for this? I think I could fit in my schedule. Come on. We got work to do. Yes, ma'am. All right, we saved her. However, she is hobbling still from her uh, sequence. At the end of her sequence, she got hobbled a bit. I'm just going to check real quick here around this area. No, I don't think anything's there, unfortunately. Now I'm going to follow uh, Ada around and see uh, what uh, she's going to do for us. I believe she has a wristband, so we're going to need her. Uh, great news is, is that uh, Ada Wong, when you escort, there is no zombies at all. That's, that's the great news right there. So I'm going to restock real quick before we uh, go to the laboratory. And there we go. There's one herb. That is fine. And I think that is it there. Okay, two herbs. That'll be uh, great for uh, the laboratory. You may never know when you uh, need them. All right, so now what we're going to do is uh, get out of here for uh, good and then uh, get to the uh, cable car. Yes, we could get inside it now thanks to Ada Wong's uh, wristband that she got from her sequence. Now before, when Leon got to it by himself, it was eh, eh, denied. Yes, we did get denied, so... Now we have the wristband on Ada. She's going to open it up for us and we're going to get inside the uh, cable car so this way we could uh, get to the underground facility or aka the underground laboratory aka Nest. So far so good. Uh, we defeated uh, the G uh, Stage 2 boss so far. Now we're going to have a nice short uh, trip to the uh, cable car and that's going to be very relaxing after a boss fight. That's very good. It's like 
Okay, you're safe for now. However, the worst isn't over yet. Yes, get used to that. One thing about this uh, cable car, Ada will give you a warning, last chance. That means uh, if you need to do something around here, uh, police station in the sewers, do it now or else it's a point of no return. So this is a point of no return when we hit the button. This tram is bound for nest. Do not exit until the final destination. You know what I was thinking? I can't wait for the FBI to raid Umbrella Headquarters and take those bastards to justice. I agree, but to be clear, you're not working in official capacity. This is a federal case. Once we get the G-Virus, I'm back on my own. Hey, Leon, trust me? You trust me? <laughs> Honestly, if I didn't, you'd probably be dead. Right. I thought I might need your help, and I was right. If you can secure the G-Virus, I can make sure what happened in Raccoon City never happens again. Ada, you say it yourself. It's a federal case. I Leon, don't have the authority. look at me. I'm a liability now. If I'm going to finish this case, you're the last hope I've got. I'm not just going to leave you here. What if you're attacked? What if you need help? Don't worry about me. I gotta see this through. And I want to see you again. I got plenty to live for, trust me. Now, arriving at Ness. Go. Please, we don't have much time. You're gonna need this. Okay. Leon, counting on you. I know. All right, we got the ID wristband uh, visitors pass level one. That's what it is. So that's the great news. Ada is now resting, so I am going to put away the uh, T uh, handle and the. Um, let's see what else there is. I think that's it. Yeah, I'll put that away since it has no fur use. So now we are inside Nest, the uh, underground laboratory of Umbrella. Yes, we're going to be investigating them. They've been doing some bad things. Like I said before, gremlins, bioweapons, zombies, liquors. Uh, I think it's the G-Monster, G-Stage 1 and 2. And I think Mr. Rudd. Uh, X is also a part of that program, wherever they are. Now it's telling us to stay behind the doors. Okay, one's open, two's open. Let's look at number three. And I don't think that's open at all. Look at the sparks. That's a bad sign, folks. We're in deep doo-doo. Well, the great news is we have arrived in the underground laboratory, a.k.a. Ness. And that's all we have for uh, today's video. Uh, this is Lord Fent signing off. Please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching and just survive.